Sorry guys, I had to cl click off the screen there for a little, little bit. <laughs> Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode uh, here of XCOM 2, The War of the Chosen, the Clone Wars campaign, and I got some things to show you real quick. I did a little bit of um, off-camera work, and um, I've not gotten rid of 99. I'm still, I I'm actually going to create a new trooper for 99 altogether. Um, just from the st standpoint of, I personally just don't like the fact that I can't customize his freaking armor. Which kind of sucks. I know that you were able to in the Spartan campaign, for whatever reason, but I'm not able to with this one. But, I've added three new soldiers. I've added Commander Bly, who's looking fantastic. I've added Commander Wolf, who's looking awesome. We'll eventually get him through training as well. And then you might see or notice a new character here on the field. This is my own personal custom character, Commander Storm. Now, the paint job and everything is not exactly what I had envisioned, but it's pretty it's pretty awesome, pretty badass and everything. Now, story behind this guy. On my other channel, uh, General Spear Creates, which if you've not checked it out, you should. It's in the link in the description below. I believe it's the second link in the description below. Um, basically, what I am going to be doing at some point on my cha on that channel is I'm going to be building a custom arc trooper. Commander Storm is the forefront of that idea, and I will tell you about that vision later on of what I have planned for that character. So it's going to be pretty awesome. But the special thing about that is it's going to be a scratch build from start to finish. Um, I have pretty much decided what specific type of armor I'm going to do. It's going to be uh, based off of the Season 3 Clone Wars Arc Trooper armor um, with some changes. Uh, with some changes and some twists and everything. I'm thinking the arms are going to be kind of the same idea of what we have going on here so the the phase two movie action arms but with like the other clone wars get up and everything so it's gonna be kind of a mix of multiple things um it's gonna have some heavy weapons i'm gonna be sporting the dc uh 15a rifle as well as the dc 15s of which i'll definitely show people how i'm gonna attach it it's gonna be on the back plating here and everything so that's gonna be pretty awesome it's gonna have a comma it's gonna have I'm gonna have the legs and everything, the chest protector, the the pauldrons. Um, I, I don't know if I'm gonna have this type type, type of pauldron setup or a def different commander setup and it went out here. I'm gonna have an RPS six rocket launcher. I'm gonna have the dual wielding pistols. It's gonna be awesome. Um, and the whole idea is that this trooper is going to serve as something that we haven't really seen in the Clone Wars, in that it being siege tactics and everything. So it's going to be a siege trooper, as uh, I'm going to call it. But that's my own custom character. It might change a little bit. Um, but that is all of what's being planned. So, back to the map. We got a grill ops in question. And I'm thinking for right now, you know, I'm gonna take I'm gonna take 99 out of this. I, I'm gonna take him out for the reason that I'm recording these episodes back to back. I'm gonna put some storm in here. I'm recording these episodes back to back, and I don't know what you all said for the last one about 99. And I would really like to read the comments and see what happens. I don't want to use him if the idea is to maybe potentially replace him with full armor and gear. Uh, which I think could be really, really cool. So, I'll read those comments. If you've missed the last episode and you want to comment in the comment section below about 99, whether I should just do a whole new character for him and get rid of the, uh, the Reaper, let me know. I know the Reaper is important. I know people like to see me play with the Reaper, but if I'm not able to customize the armor in the way that I want to, then there's not really any point in playing with it, because it's kind of, you know, Clone Wars. So, there's that. And looking at it, of course, from the Clone perspective. 
All right, so let's go ahead and do this. Uh, Operation Crimson Druid. Neutralize the field commander. Easy difficulty, supposedly. Then, uh, then we get a reward of Nat Nichols for, as a scientist. And each soldier on this mission will gain a charge, a, a single charge ability of the conceal ability, which is pretty cool. So we're taking out Cody, Rex, Ahsoka, and Obi Wan. And we're also taking out my custom character of Commander Storm. It's the only I, I wanna I wanna reiterate this. It is the only custom character that I'm putting into this campaign. Eventually, I will probably do a Clone Wars series in which you all will provide custom characters and whatnot. Um of which I will be talking about in an update video fairly soon. Um so, and because I, I, I get that every single season. I got that especially in the second season and, of course, this season of the Clone Wars uh, playthroughs and everything on XCOM. So, I think I will dedicate a series at some point, but I'm going to... It's going to be dedicated... I'm going to say this right off the bat. It's going to be dedicated to those who follow me on Patreon. If you follow me on Patreon... Or not Patreon. If you support me on Patreon, I will definitely put a custom character in for you. Um, the only reason why I'm doing it as such is because one, you know, marketing. Uh, two is if you really want a series like that, I really want you all to be able to promote it. Um, I would love to be able to do it. I have no problem doing it. It's just. If there's going to be that much of a demand, I want to really see if you all want to support me on that. And it could be, it could be like my first Patreon-supported series is how I'm going to look at it. So, if you already want the series, please let me know. Please let me know. Um, so, that's how it's going to be. As for this series, we're going to continue on. We're going to go on this mission. Obi-Wan's a little bit tired. He's a little bit, you know, kind of low on the energy, which is understandable. He did just do both a mission and a covert ops mission so he's a little tired so let's go ahead and continue dum 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 going out with commander storm some of you might look at the thumbnail and go who is this guy sky ranger deployed oh ladies and gentlemen you will see you will definitely see before the end of this all right let's go ahead and begin this and I'm thinking, even though I have most of the ARC Troopers being the, the Akimbo classes... Um... I would like... And I, I don't know what I'm going to do with Practical Mox's character, for that matter, either. I really don't know. I'd like to spam that guy, too. Even though the skirmisher is really, really good. I might set myself the challenge of just using the only the, the classes that I have installed. We just got a tip from a resistance contact in the field. A high-ranking advent officer was spotted moving through the area with limited escorts. This could be a chance for us to disrupt their current operations and throw off their command structure. Your orders are to eliminate that officer with extreme prejudice. I think we can do that. All right, let's go. To Seattle we go. Menace one five, we're tracking the Advent General and his escorts, but we don't have an exact fix on their location. Sweep the area and eliminate the target along with any other hostiles that stand in your way. The squad is in position and concealed. With the environmental conditions down there, they should be able to stay hidden without revealing each other if they're sighted. Sounds like a plan. Believe. Yeah, I'm gonna be really glad when we get uh, Move it. those voice packs for the Jedi. Why, hello, okay, we got this guy down range too. Also got this hack. Which, what's this hack gonna look like here? That I don't know. Ooh, that's not that good. Let's not roll those dice just yet. Roger that, sir. Let's let's not do that just yet. 
Rex, I'm gonna move him up to here. Let's go. And Storm, I'm gonna move him Let's move fast. to fall at the rear back here. Get ready for attack. Roger, holding. Could do force speed, but I don't see it as being Copy. necessary. Moving that area, sir. Okay. We have an interesting sachet about this guy. Moving to position. I'm on it. All right. I think what we'll do is we'll move Ahsoka over Moving. this way. Bit far away to deal with him. Could do leap strike. I do need to get Kenobi more kills. So that's a guarantee. I would like to get Storm in here too. Decent enough bead on this guy. I'll go Overwatch. I'll do this with Kenobi. We're visible here. Okay. Hostile terminated. Got some advent here. Oh, nice hit. Of course, we got these guys coming in. All right, let's bring in Cody over this way. 42 on this guy, 17 over here on this guy. That's a miss. Fair enough. Oh, why did I do that? That's got to be the commander. That's good, though, because Target we did find him. Confirmed. That's the general. Take him out before they can escape. We won't get another shot at this. Moving to position. And you're moving closer to us, which is good. Um, you... Nice, Cody. That takes care of one. We're picking up an inbound advent transport. The aliens are going to try and extract the general from the AO. Don't let him get on board that ship. Okay, disoriented. That's not good. I missed! Incoming! Over here! Missed the target. Affirmative. Okay. I'm on it. I do see him. Moving to position. It's a risk with Ahsoka. Watch the flanks. But I will take it. Come on, Storm. Oh, nice try. Ah, incoming over here. Dead. They're 
Obi-Wan's gonna do some work here. Oh, miss. Alright, let's see what happens. Oh my god. Oh, another miss! How? That was amazing. Oh, you're coming in closer. You are not running away. Ow. Got some advent here. Oh no. That was a bad idea. Okay, pistol whip here. Come on, Rex. Thank you. Let's see. Let's do speed. Let's see here. I can't really get the commander up there. Bleeding out. Okay. That's not good. She's still alive. Stupid commander. I'm gonna take it. Ow. Um. Well, now. Yeah, you're bleeding. My position. Come on, Kenobi. Okay, one down. down. Two freaking many to go. Ahsoka does have a little bit of time. Three turns. Nice, Cody. Menace one five kill confirmed. That's how it's done. We need to clear the area of any remaining hostiles. We can't allow them to recover the general's body. Buy me a few seconds. Oh man, that was risky. That was really, really risky. I'm coming, Ahsoka. I'm coming. Move 
Hit storm confirmation. Mission accomplished. Whoa, <laughs> that was unexpected. I hope you're ready to be famous. Absolutely. Wow, storm. I that was a risk. I'll say that much. That was tragedy struck today as another loyal Advent citizen was lost to XCOM criminals. A memorial service is mandatory for all citizens who maintained daily contact. I was really thinking Ahsoka was gonna go down there a little bit. And Sure enough, she's probably going to be out for, like, a while. Poor Snips. Oh, yeah. We'll see you in a month, Ahsoka. <laughs> Cody. Combat protocol for you. Hello, Commander. Alright. Now, let's go see Commander Storm. Now, I've thought long and hard about what I want to do for him. And I'm thinking a specialist. I thought about the Nkimbo class, but I'm thinking a specialist. Just because for the, the Arc Troopers, I do need a medic. So, that's what we're going to do. Plus, it'll allow me to keep... Uh, this weapon here, at least. The DC-15A. Of which I will give it... Ooh. Yes and We've yes. We've been picking up some weird transmissions lately. It sounds a little like German, but it's hard to tell. Commander Storm's rifle. Nice, nice, nice. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. I... Fantastic. Alright. Ahsoka's gonna be out for a while. <laughs> like, like, a while. <laughs> so. Avenger plotting new course. Luckily, we have other Jedi that can fill in for her, but, um. Yeah. Sweet! Alright, next two we're gonna get in here. We are both lost, and in turn cause great loss for others. I shed blood in my master's name, just as you send others to shed blood in yours. There is a fine line between honor and hypocrisy. We're getting Wolf in here for a Kimbo training, because he's a dual-wielding son of a gun. All right, resistance ring is done. Commander, the factions you have contacted are well equipped to track down the chosen. Their knowledge will be invaluable in helping XCOM locate and eliminate these threats. The benefits we gain from working with the resistance factions on their covert operations are a major boon to our efforts, but there are also risks involved. Our soldiers could potentially be attacked or taken captive while in the field. So it's not as easy a decision as it may seem. Word is, we've got a new trick or two available, Commander. Maybe we should give them a try. Commander, Mox has been captured. We should do everything we can to get him back before the Chosen do God knows what to him. That's... Uh, yeah. We should. I'm thinking here, ladies and gentlemen. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. 
If the Chosen shows up, I'm gonna have... No. No. I need something with boom. Lots of boom. Thorn, get out there. Covert is our specialty. Let's just hope your people can keep up. I would hope so. We have made a number of new discoveries, Commander. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so I think... This is a little crazy, but I think I'm going to go for magnetic weapons. I will begin our research immediately. It's gonna be slow. Commander, we can now work to establish contact with local resistance groups operating out of regions around the globe. Once we've collected sufficient intel to make contact, we'll need to scan the target region for the operative signal. Okay, we can get a soldier now. Avenger plotting Who knows, this new soldier might be, you know, our new 99. I don't know. Clear out alien machinery, which is now good and up and running. Excellent. I'm gonna get some power going now. Do it. Six days. That'll be nice. That will be nice. Nice. Wolf is now our new Akimbo soldier. Who else do we need to get in here? Bly. Live zero five two. Let's get you in for sharpshooter training. Right? That wasn't supposed to be it, but that's okay. I can switch that around. Alright, so sharpshooter training it is for Bly. supply line we have an opportunity to salvage some high-value materials assuming we can clear out the alien forces guarding the site first you don't say for Western United States I think we will go ahead and take care of this or at least attempt to commander I'm getting faint traces of a signal coming through someone on the ground is trying to reach us but I can't make it out keep your eyes peeled for possible contacts down there all right so this is now our first moderate difficulty mission, and I am very concerned. Storm is going to take us out on this one, and I want to edit him actually just a little bit, just a little teeny tiny bit, because hard luck, I'd rather have him maybe be as intense. So Storm is going to lead this one, Echo is going to follow up. So two, two specialists there. I think that's going to be fine. I think I want to send Anakin Skywalker out on this one. Just to have some sort of Jedi presence down there. I'm going to send fives out on this one as well. For some sharpshooter action. And of course I need to fix some things. As his weapons should not look like that. Uh, customize weapon. Black. There we go. So fives is going to be headed out there, and we're also going to bring out. Do I dare bring out Wolf on this one? That's a lot of squatties. That's a lot of squaddies on a very on a moderate difficult mission. I think we can do it. It's just gonna be it's gonna be interesting. It's gonna be really interesting. We got medical stuff. We will have and get you a nano skittle vest, Anakin. Stop it. Anakin, where's his... Oh, Obi-Wan has it, and he's on a mission. That's right. 
one. Gold one. Ooh! Ooh. <laughs> hmm. This looks nice. I like all these uh, these options here so far. I'm gonna build. <sighs> should I? I think I should, just in case, because Anakin, you never know. Nano scale fest for you. All right, this is our team for next episode. Um, it's gonna be rather interesting to see how this one goes. Uh, but we're taking out Wolf, Fives, Storm, Anakin, and Echo. And it will be interesting. Uh, feel free, as always, to Hulk smash that like button, ladies and gentlemen. Feel free to comment, comment section below if you're new. Do not forget to subscribe. And as always, may the force be ever in your favor.